Hello, my name's Ian Asprey of BXI. Yes. Hi, I'm Atzo from BXI. Now, how did the new uh, EP come together? How did it come together? Um, I'm a long time devotee of Boris, Boris's music, and I started to, to reach out through uh, their agent initially about two years ago, maybe three years ago. I saw them play at the Knitting Factory during the Pink Tour, and uh, I was pursuing them to, to play with the Colt for many years, but never really came together. <laughs> and then um, the introduction was made, I think, through Stephen and, um, and Greg, wasn't it? Oh. Yeah, through Stephen and Greg. Introduction to Atsuo and to Boris. And from there, we started to talk about maybe collaboration with music. And uh, I was sent some music, and I listened to it, and I was very overwhelmed by the, uh, the depth and the quality of the music. So it was very difficult to choose um, songs, but um, that was pretty much it. So from the presentation of the music, we went to the studio and created our first, what would you call it, is it an EP? I don't know. Is it EP or? What do you, what is concept? I don't know. <laughs> Disc. Sure. Recordings. Sure. Yeah. Now, with you only having released four songs, are there more tracks you recorded? Is there going to be a further co uh, collaboration? I hope. I hope too. I think it's very successful. We've really enjoyed the experience. It's been amazing working with them. They're very professional. Now, you know, I, got to, I really enjoyed the three tracks, the new ones. How did you decide on which cult track to record? That wasn't me. うーん。とりあえずカルトン。アブソルト。ね、まあ、あの、ラブってアルバムすごい。過去にも未来にもすごいアクセスするような。うん。その普遍的なあれ、まあ、その中でもあの曲がすごい多変性を持ってて、今や
Uh, Jesse Sykes. Yes, yeah. Jesse yeah. Sykes is playing, and you're playing. We just so it's Alter. Jesse Sykes BXI tomorrow night. Cool. <laughs> now I know uh, you weren't here for the earlier Sun show, but uh, I think most people describe that as the loudest they've ever heard. I mean, do you which think one? The one that was. The uh, one preceding this? Right, November uh, yes. at Brooklyn Masonic. I was living in the city at the time, but I was on tour. So, because um, I was here for like three years, I just basically went back to California for two, about two weeks when I moved back. But I was in the city for three years. I saw Sun play on that tour in, uh, in Pasadena, in California. And it was excessively loud, but Boris, I think, are louder. Now, the one thing with Especially all the, the visual, there's a lot of visual rock elements to Boris that <laughs> some don't have. It's a lot more of a theatrical show with, with Boris. Mm -hmm. Now, the one thing with all the Southern Lord shows have been the crazy tour merchandise. I mean, do you guys have anything out with you this time around? Ooh, special merchandising. How about the BXI? Apparently it sold out yesterday. Greg, Greg was telling me that uh, yeah. the BXI vinyl sold out at ATP yesterday. Oh, the pink vinyl, 500 copies? No, thing, yeah. all of it. It's gone. Wow. There is none left. The vinyl is sold out. So, so we're going to try and scrounge some up for tomorrow night. All right. Is there anything you want uh, people to know about the show or BXI? Yeah, don't sleep on this. All your little metal hipsters out there this is this is the show that you have to beg borrow and steal to get into and i know it's really tight i don't think there's many tickets left if if, if there are any left at all so i would recommend very highly you come to this performance it's uh it's definitely the high point of the season great thanks a lot guys Do you want to say anything as well? yeah all anything special all things out of control all things out of control yeah. especially his wardrobe <laughs> It's also a fashion show. It says Alter, BXI Sun, Jesse, Jesse Sykes, and Matsuo's Wardrobe. <laughs> Special show. <laughs>